All right. What I decided to do is I made these a half inch thick. Okay. They are six and three fourths inches in length. But as far as thicknesses, they are they are an inch and a half thick. So, and once I t once I kind of play around with them over a little bit, it's gonna look it's gonna work for the sides. So make your sides a half inch thick. Uh, this way. Next, what you're gonna have to do is sew all edges again. Sew all the edges. But this time, what we're going to do is we are going to make it go up to. We're going to make it go up to here. If I can make it, st yeah. See, we're going to make it go up to there. And once, uh, once all these sides are sewn together, we are then going to hot glue them onto each side. It may be, it may take a while, but please be patient. It's it's turning out great, folks. If you made it this far, it's turning out great. So, pretty much stitch these sides all the way around. Then, once that is done, we get ready to hot glue them to the sides. But remember, we got to have make sure that there's a really good gap sp space in between before we do it. Okay? Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, we gotta make sure that this space is a little. We gotta make sure that this gap here has a lot more space. But yeah, that's what you need to do next. All right. Now what we're getting ready to do now is hot glue the sides here. Okay. We're gonna hot glue these sides. We're gonna hot glue the top. And the sides here, like only up to a certain point though, like maybe up to here, like maybe around in here, okay? While I'm thinking about it, I'm getting ready to show you. But be please be careful, okay? Because you don't know that this hot glue may go through the sway, and we don't want that. Sorry, folks. Trying to have a steady hand while doing this is not easy, so please don't like, don't totally hate me because I'm not providing good focused pictures. Okay. Okay. What we're gonna do now is I already put hot glue on this, and I think it already hardened. Not quite, but and you carefully place this on the very, very edges like this like so okay you have to be very careful of this okay uh... hold on one second please okay we're finally over to the flap now what i did here is i placed a dot and what you do here is you make like a triangular shape kind of triangular shape you cut out that triangle shape to the dot, and then once that happens, you fold over and stitch. Like, fold over and stitch once that happens. Alright, um, what you do now is you take two snaps, one of these and one of these right here, if you can see. One of the snaps and one of the clips, and hot glue the snap or the clip here on there right there and then you see where that dot is I made that dot to, so I would make sure that when I once I close it it that snap would automatically snap right there so that's what I did before I hot glued this and before I hot glued this I kinda recorded of how I I kind of determined where I should place the snap and the clip. So hot glue the, the clip here and the snap where those where the dots you where you place the dots 
and the main aspect of this is completed. The only thing you have to do now is just do the little beads and the little stripes down here and it, sh it is completely done. And the best thing about this, folks, it's it's kind of functional. It really, really is. You can put your, put your cell phone in here and some money. Maybe a camera if you have like one of those thin ones, but other than that, it's really functional. Um, I hope this helps. I really enjoy making this as much as you. I hope this really helps. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.